So you want to make a homemade Mother's Day card? Well, I'm going to show you how. You just pop open a marker, grab yourself some paper, fold it in half, then you just scribble in some random message. Just kidding! Hey you! Do you ever feel like you want to make a homemade Mother's Day card? Because you feel it'll save the environment and improve the lives of whose you loves? Well, I have a solution for you, because... What? Hey guys, welcome back to Perkimato, and today I am going to be showing you guys how to make a DIY super easy, super simple, and really cute Mother's Day card. My mom's like right outside, so I can't say it very loud, but it's very easy, and yeah, let's just get into the video. Okay, the ingredients you're going to be needing to make this card are some watercolor paint and water, a ruler, a paintbrush, a black marker, I'm using a sharpie, um, a pencil, and a piece of watercolor paper that is 8 inches by 4 inches, which I happily cut out of some watercolor paper that I already had, and you'll also need some scissors. So with my piece of watercolor paper that is 4 inches by 8 inches, I'm going to fold it in half to make a perfect square. You can also use the edge of your scissors to help make it more creasy. So now with your pencil, you're going to want to outline a plant, and I have all these different plants that I hand drew to make this wall decor, but um, you can choose any plant. You can find like some on Google and just try and copy them. They're really easy. I'm going to be, you can do one plant or two, but I'm going to be doing, I think this one and that one, that one, maybe. So kind of like, yeah, but if you want to copy any of these plants that I have on here, like you totally can. I'm just gonna show you them. So I did a light sketch of um, a plant that I had on my thing over here, and basically it doesn't have to be great, like you're gonna go over it with a marker later, but first we're going to watercolor it. I added this other simple cactus just for fun. Now once your water is completely dry, you can even use like a hairdryer to help dry it, you're going to go over with your black marker and outline it. And you don't have to do this, you can just leave it with the pencil because that looks fine. But I just want to outline it to give it a more bold look. So then I wrote, hey mom, you are planty for me, and it's a pun, I'm sorry, okay, I said that's so sort of like dolly, but it's a pun, and it's bad, it's a bad pun, but if you're bad and punny, <laughs> this will be a great card for you. So I went over my pencil with my, with another marker, a black marker, and now it's beautiful, beautiful card, yes, indeed. Alright guys, that's basically it, this is the finished product, how do you like it, how do you like it, yes, it's cheesy. But I really like it and um, you can go ahead and write whatever you want in here and also you can dress up the inside if you want Wait, hold on. I'm gonna do that. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so I did the inside. It's beautiful. I know. Okay. So yeah, that's basically it um, That's a really easy quick and easy craft if you enjoy this video Make sure you like subscribe comment down below because I love talking to you guys and I will see you in my next video Bye. <laughs> the video watch my hair Subscribe and like the video, and most of all, share the channel. I'm eating chips, by the way.